subscribe, like and see you. Hello all my dear students, it's Ms. Suras once again in front of you to help. Today I'm going to tell you about an important essay from second unit Ecology and Change from class 12 which is Hurry Trip to Avoid a Bad Star. This essay is written by two American geographers Leela M. Bishop and Barry C. Bishop. These two American geographers had visited Nepal in the year 1971. They had spent their 15 adventurous months in the ruler part of Nepal, which is Karnali region. They had done their research project for 15 months in Karnali region. They had spent their 15 months researching about Karnali region, its people, their life and living style. They had faced various problems during that time. They had made their journey from Jumla to Nepal guns on foot but they have been successful in their research project related with Karnali region and its people. This essay has presented the account of Karnali region and its people. While the writers were there, they set up their tents and observed the people of Karnali whole regions. They spent their 15 months though they did not know their language. According to the writers, the people of Karnali are spending their life in a very difficult part of hilly region of Nepal. During their 15 months, they got chance to learn various things related with Karnali region, its people, culture, etc. According to them, the people of Karnali are quite innocent, laborious and uneducated. They are quite ignorant about external world. They know very little about outside world. In a very difficult geographical part of Nepal, they are living their life depending on their own or animal's strength. They are ignorant about soil erosion and deforestation. They are very superstitious too. They live in harmony with nature. Their lands don't support them to provide enough to eat. That's why they engage themselves in jobs in Nepal Ganj. They are quite cooperative and helpful. The people of Karnali depend on trade. They are economically linked with low land region which is Nepal Guns. This trip is very much important for the people of Karnali to run their life smoothly in Jumla. This hurried trip is very much essential for them to raise their bad star. During their journey they met many people on the way to Nepal Guns. They even talked with them. They knew about the main region behind their hurried trip to Nepal. They found people carrying baskets with different kind of things to sell in the market of Nepal. They found people carrying medicinal herbs, hand knitted sweaters, hussies, blankets, etc. in their baskets. With that trade, they gained some amount to support their weak condition. On the way, both writers met a Chetri woman whose husband had left her 15 years ago. She requested both of the writers to send her husband back to home if they met him. The writers found some men in the height of 9,000 feet in the forest processing silajit. Silajit is a tar-like substance that is used for making different kind of medicinal items. Silajit is found in the cracks of rocky mountains. There is risk of life taking Silajit from the high cliffs. Those people were processing Silajit on the way to Nepal. For them, that trip was very much important. Near Tarai, the writers found most of the salt trees leafless. They met ladies feeding their god salt leaves. They even overheard the chopping sound of trees everywhere. According to them, people did not have consciousness about their future. 
When they reached Nepal, they heard jackal, bats, mule, block carts, etc. They saw the block cart for the first time in their life. They were quite excited to see vehicles after a long time. In the market of Nepal, they saw people selling and buying various goods. With that trade amount, they bought cotton clothes, aluminium wear, iron wear, spiced jewelries, distillery equipments, and other necessary items for their survival. Finally, both writers returned to Jumla to complete their research project. They gained a lot of knowledge and experiences related with Karnali region and its people. Now, I would like to present you some important questions and their answers which will help you. Thank you for watching this video. We'll meet again in my next video. Until then, bye-bye. Take care and don't forget to subscribe and like my videos. Thank you very much.